we're going to demonstrate now VMC and the recovery when hitting VMC. Remember, VMC is a function of uh, your altitude, your weight. It's, it's when the plane starts rolling on you. Uh, yeah, theoretically, it shouldn't happen to go below going that blue line. But, but what happens when training in the higher areas, like our Las Vegas, we sat at 2,000 feet, and it's hot. If you, the student is trained by stopping the yaw and hence the roll of VMC, he will always see the stall first. He won't, it'll never see the roll. The plane will stall first. So when training, what we do is we don't deflect the rudder all the way. We put in a little bit and hold the nose up. And when you see the yaw, we recover, recover on the yaw. Otherwise, a student, he'd never see, he'd never see the yaw, he'd only feel the star, he would say that that's not BMC and he would never do the proper things to get out of it. Okay, so we're going to put everything forward and we're going to close the left engine with the throttle only. Now, I like to say with BMC when I teach it, remember BMC is a loss into directional control. So could you lose directional control if you never had it? Well, I ask you this. Could you lose a hundred bucks if you never had a hundred bucks? No. So, I have, as you can see, blue line. And if you look out the window, I'm, see, I'm staring at a point on the rise, and you can back it up with a heading here about 330, but that's directional control. Now, to simulate this, I'm going to change one thing. I'm just going to change my pitch. The hard part about teaching a pilot VMC is this. We're pilots. We don't lose directional control very well. We maintain con directional control. We are wired that way. So you're asking someone who's wired, who's wired to control things to lose control. We don't do that well. So when you, when you start teaching this, and a guy goes up and he starts yawing and rolling, he goes to stop it. No, it's a demonstration of the loss of directional control. That's the hardest part about teaching. So I'm gonna just pitch up a little here, okay? And I'm just gonna wait. It happens every day. And you'll see it slowly start to yaw to the left. There it goes there, and he, in a little bit, the throttle closes it, so I'll reduce power sufficiently on the operating engine while simultaneously reducing the angle of attack. Slowly pitch down until I get to the blue line, which tells me it's safe to put the throttle back in. When I do, I add a little right bank to maintain directional control again.